So residents of Ngode Island in Homa Bay County have come out in defense of Pastor Ezekiel Odero, who is currently in police custody, following allegations of mass killings at the New Life Prayer Center. So according to family and friends of the preacher, Ezekiel Odero was a good, a God-fearing man who grew up deeply rooted in the Christian faith and had hinted at plans of opening his own church when he grew up. And as Laura Tino now reports, the little-known island is now engulfed in a somber mood as they ponder on the fate of their students who had been benefiting from full scholarship courtesy of Pastor Ezekiel Odero. At the outlying waters of Lake Victoria is Ngothe Island, where a tight-knit community lives. Here, everyone knows their neighbor, and today they gather at this homestead with agony painted on their faces. This is the home of Pastor Ezekiel Odero. Residents say he grew up as a staunch member of the Ngothe SDA Church. His family reminiscing how Ezekiel had always talked about setting up his own church. Miaka ni meishi ya apa ngode ni miaka ishirini na tatu ni kijua pasta Ezekiel kama muubiri na muanakuaya. Nilimpata apa ngode kama ni muanakuaya. During his uh, childhood, because he grew up here, uh, nothing like this uh, has been, uh, Ezekiel has never been associated to something of this kind. So as uh, uh, on behalf of the family and even the community, we are not very happy. Ezekiel Ombok Odero attended Ngothe Primary School and later joined Mombasa Polytechnic, where his family says he dropped out due to lack of school fees. However, the preacher seemed to have found footing and the next time he visited the isolated island, he came as the leader of New Life Prayer Center based in Malindi. He reportedly landed in a chopper, flanked by some of his church members, and came bearing gifts for the entire island. Wengine awakuwa hata na manyumba. Pastor Ezekiel alikuja, aka sort out all the debts in, for school fees. And uh, even those who were having some other issues, he sorted them out. Hata sahi, watoto wanarejea shuleni, jameni, tunaenda kufa. So the extended family members could not confirm whether the preacher had any formal training on theology. They maintain that their son is innocent. The link between Pastor Sikil and uh, uh, Pastor Paul Machesi, I on behalf of the family I really condemn and I believe when as per now that is false and justice also will prevail. prevail. Ezekiel Lombok Odero was arrested on April 27th and is being investigated for several offenses, including fraud, money laundering, murder, and child cruelty. Laura Otieno, Citizen TV.